coming up next on African Chant Mummies. Excuse me, what? <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it. No, tell me anything. Like, I don't understand what he's talking about. Like, well, oh, I think they were trying to interrogate the syndicate guys, and then Shiva got away. That still doesn't make any sense. Like, I don't know what their sudden realization is here. Like, it doesn't make any it's sense. It's probably just a bad translation or something. Well, it's not even a bad translation. They changed the story. Yeah. Well, I mean, like... At least they kept all the music intact. Yeah. Oh, except, except they had to take out the ashes theme. Oh, the grenade exploded in my hand. Sure. The holy hand grenade of Antioch. You didn't oh. count down the three. First, thou shalt count to three. No more, no less. Three is the number thou shalt count to. The number thou shalt count to shall be three. Four shalt thou not count, nor shalt thou count to two, unless then proceeding on to three. Once three be the third number be reached, thou shalt chuck us the holy hand grenade and blah blah blah. Pull us thy enemies into tiny bits. Something like that. <laughs> One, no wait, five is right out. <laughs> Once three be the third number be reached, blah blah blah. <laughs> Ready? On. One, two, Five, three, sir, three. <laughs> <laughs> One time in high school, we had to like recreate scenes in a in a theater class, mm -hmm. um, and one and some of the people did that. Like one of the groups recreated that scene. Just one, two, five, three, sir, three. Yeah. And then we did my group. I I was stuck with Derek and like the shyest little like Mexican kid. <laughs> Like I'm, like, I'm just saying, he was, he had, like, the quietest little voice. He was like, ah. But, like, we, we recreated a scene from, um, <laughs> a two scenes from Back to the Future. Oh. And, like, we had to give him a really tiny part because he was so quiet. We had to, like, he give him... He was so quiet, then why did he take an acting class? I don't remember. It wasn't, like, an acting class, really. A it was, theater, um, drama class. I, it wasn't necessarily... I'm trying to remember what the heck it was. Scarab. Scarab. I don't know. It's a, I put that enemy down. It, it's you don't have enough scarabs. It was like it was like a speech class. Oh. In a speech that was required. Okay. So it wasn't theater. Now that I think of it. But yeah, I had. Uh, Did you like that totally dank delicious Star Fox Adventures reference I made just now? No. I don't know what Star Fox is. <laughs> You've only Jeez. played like a million of those games on the show. Two. We've played three of them now. Because we played the original, we're playing Adventures, and we're playing Assault right now. I definitely didn't. Okay. One sec. Alright. Alright, get your get your phone. Not your phone, your apple. Okay, these guys. No. <laughs> Did you see that? He picked up the apple and your life was just squandered to nothing. Oh, God. Where'd the other guy go? There he is. There he is. He changed his name to Bruce. Bruce. Yeah, he's like Big D or something. Or another one. No, the, the Zero. Look, seriously, look, he has three health bars. Yeah. They both have three health bars, and you killed me. Of all so people, of right. all people that kill me, it was you. It. <sighs> like I cannot see how many. It's just like <clears throat> just kill them both. Oh, I hate when they go off screen like that. I know it's it like, drives me why? crazy. It's like you can still hit me from off screen. With that yeah, giant whip of yours. you. Because the cameras decide to arbitrarily stop moving. And it's not arbitrarily stop moving. It's They programmed it that way. Yeah. They programmed it arbitrarily. What, what, what would you rather have it? I would rather have it so that they don't go off screen. That's what I'd like. Well, it doesn't mean it's arbitrary. <clears throat> We're still fighting them. Yeah. Still. I forgot to start the part on the iPad, whatever. So I can know. That's another, that's like another Metallica song. Nothing else matters. No, wait. Swollen Nothing else matters. When ready to burst. Oh, yeah. A taste of my own to quench her dead body's thirst. Quench this dead body's thirst. That's not even the most disgusting song written by Cannibal Corpse, you know that? I, I, I wouldn't doubt it. 
I uh, read the lyrics to a new song, uh, not a new one, but from the same album called Necro Pedophile. Oh, jeez. That's the worst thing I've ever, worst lyrics. It's even a creepy song. Like, even, even listening to it, I get freaked out because, like, the end of the song, the end of the song, it just cuts to, it just hard cuts from the end of the music. It doesn't fade or anything. It just cuts directly to kids playing in a, in a, at a playground and, like, their screams. I'm like, oh, God, that's freaky. Yeah, why do you listen to this band again? Is the music that good? I don't really know. That's not like all. A lot of their other stuff isn't like that disgusting. That was kind of their most disgusting album. Mm. Whatever. How many albums do they have? Like 14 Jeez. or so. so Anyways. They're a reasonably successful band. They're like the most successful death metal band, and in the really? grand, in the oh, definitely. In the grand scheme of things, that doesn't get much support. They probably don't make that much money in a year. Mm. I thought that something like Metallica would be a little more... Metallica, Metallica is not death metal, and Metallica is like thousands of times more popular than... Yeah, that's what I would have thought. Yeah, Metallica, they're, they're like millionaires, whereas like Cannibal Corpse, they probably make like $50,000 a year, honestly. Mm -hmm. But whatever. Doesn't matter. They still play in like little venues. Even though they've been a band for 25 years. By the way, I only have two lives left before... Oh yeah. Having... Drawn. Okay, seriously though, we're not really stressing the difficulty too much, but yeah, we're both getting destroyed much more. Jesus like Christ. he's already used two continues. We're in the last in the last playthrough we did. Just this, like and then bear in mind, folks, we're playing this directly after the Japanese version, so this is with some practice. Yeah, some practice. <laughs> I've died. I died like three times. I'm actually I'm actually doing relatively well right now. It's just like the game has three difficulty settings. Why do they need to make it so hard? Oh, why'd they have to dick you over with the with the easy ending? Yeah. Ugh, come on. You, you love the clicking of the buttons, oh. everybody. Yeah, it's it's like that SNK fighting game all over again. Uh, they are fighting too. Yeah. That was like clicking, click them again. It's like click them again. <laughs> you might say that that video was clickbait. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> clickbait. Shut up. <laughs> Look, there, there are like so many more mook mookies. Mookies. There's so many more MacGuffins. She was Wookie cooking, cooking. Wookie cookie. Ooh, I got uppercut by Bono. Yeah, Wookie cookies and Yoda soda. <laughs> My ding dong, it just. God. Proceeds to touch controller afterwards. It's my own controller. Yeah, it's also Bork, so there's that. It's working fine right now. I forgot it was having issues. Oh, yeah, they renamed Lumber to Plank in this one. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Do they think people would confuse it for the other word that means cheap ass hoe? That was Lutter. No. Yeah. Exactly, so they think that people would confuse lumber and lumber. She's just waiting there, see her? It's just like, fuck that shit. Just make the goddamn enemy come out and fight. It's just like, they had three games to get this right, and they couldn't do it. Well, that's common for all beat-em-ups. It's not like this is the only one that does yeah. that. Cred. This is your last life, and you're already almost dead. Yeah, I'm, I'm not trying to play this horribly. Okay. The next room is where we'll die anyway, or I might be able to make it through, but Michael will not. Um, Michael just died. Yeah. Guess who killed him? Was it you? I think it might have been me. I think it, I, I think I threw I, it. I'm telling you, you will always finish me off. I think. I, oh, it's not the only time it's ever happened, or like the first time. God. It's funny because it's a dominatrix in a position of which she would be dominated. See. Are you, are, are you serious right now? Oh, I didn't, it didn't mean it was actually funny, but it's just... Okay, so it's just me. Now, here's probably where the game ends, because these are so much harder. They each have... They have more, They have two and a half as... Two and a half times as much health. They, each, they have like two and a half health bars. Or, or uh, three, I think. No, two, two and a half. And now it's a lot tougher that I have to do them both myself. You gonna add some commentary instead of being on your phone there, Mikey? Um... No. 
<laughs> no. Hey, man, just crank up, just show. just crank up the music here. Alright. By the way, we didn't, we failed to mention that these are the twins from Raid One. Or similar, at least. Well, they have the same names. <gasps> Mona Lisa, presumably. How would you ever know if they have the same names? I'll like, who, who else could they be? Two other characters that fight? It's just like, I always thought they were the same twins. Because they wear similar outfits. You know. I'll, I'll look it up. Why not? Go ahead. Well, make sure you comment. Sure. Streets of Rage Wiki. Mona and Lisa. In the original Streets of Rage, they are identified as Blaze clones. They make first appearance as major bosses together in Stage 5. Um, let's see. They are non-canon in Streets of Rage 2. In Streets of Rage 3, they make their appearance one more as acrobats in a bar located at a dance club in Stage 2. They still bear many of Blaze's moves, plus more acrobatic moves and are much stronger than they were in the original, with some team assisting moves as well. Unlike their original appearance, they will successfully land a throne. Oh yeah. That sucks. Alright. Yeah, so they are indeed the same people, apparently. Even though they already died twice in the first game. Well, you know what? <laughs> Fucking Mr. X died like three times, and so is Shiva. It's just like at this point, it's, there's no continuity. I wonder. I wonder what'll happen in like Streets of Rage Four if that ever game ever gets made. Yeah, it's just like Mr. X just shows up. Yeah, Mr. X is just fine again. Like, oh, I got resurrected. It's Streets of Rage Resurrection. <laughs> That's the subtitle. It'd be really cool if they made Streets of Rage Four like exactly like Streets of Rage Two or Three. You know what? I'm, uh, I'm honestly exactly, surprised they haven't because like with Mega Man Nine and Ten. Exactly. Well, I was gonna say exactly like Nine and Ten instead of making like Two Point Five D, which all other like remakes have been like lately. I hate like that Two Point Five D. Hey, I actually made it past them and I'm still going, even though I died too many times. Mm. Well, like, th like there's no chance. I've got three lives left. Mm. Or whatever. I think we're a little less octane action than we thought we would be at this point. We're just kind of oh, tired. Yeah. By the way, the um, there is a difference in terms of story. Like in in the Japanese version, it's just like, oh yeah, there's a general Petrov and the nations, and there's some sort of war threatening to happen here. In this game, it's just the chief of police gets kidnapped by the syndicate, and they try to rescue him. But then, so basically, the chief of police takes the place of General Petrov. Oh yeah. Like weird. So Whatever. this game actually feels like it, the American version, in terms of story, has more continuity with the first two. Yeah, kind of. I don't know if they're weird. Yeah. And the Japanese, they're they're both weird. It's kind of, it's kind of weird to have cutscenes in the game. Yeah, but it's not like they're that long, so. No, it's not even really bad. It's just, it's just weird. So anyways, yeah, here's the hard level. It just gets harder at this point, because they just gangbang you like that. Yeah, and when you do two-player, don't they give you more enemies? Uh, I'm pretty sure they do. I don't know. So the fact that I died does not help. <clears throat> no, it doesn't. Nice work, Mikey. <laughs> Says the person who killed me last. Absolutely. Damn straight. But you know what? You shouldn't have been so low on health. <laughs> <clears throat> That's a good case of victim blaming right there. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna report you to Tumblr. Will you quit join me? Hey, look at that. He threw me three times in a row. <laughs> yeah. Ethan, I want you to put a Hanna Barbera sound effect each time he throws you. Why? Because it would be funny that way. It's just like, woo! <laughs> Did you see me jump over that cliff? Yeah, I did. That was yeah, I was... Guess I'm doing better than you'd thought. <clears throat> I 
is where the focus starts to happen. <laughs> I got it. We got a focus. Yep, we must focus. Focus. Aha! That's what you get for being stupid. <laughs> By the way, didn't the cutscene say they were going to a mall and not a construction no. site? No, they said it's headed to the construction site. Uh, there's something about a mall. Yeah, something about a mall. He said they saw, they saw him leaving the mall or something. Mm. No, they definitely said construction site. Let's head to the construction site. They didn't say why they're heading to the construction site. He just said, let's head to the construction site. <laughs> That was nice. That was beautiful. How many lives do you have left? Three. Okay. So you're on your last continue? Yeah. So I might make it a little while yet. It's like you beat the game. Yeah, oh my. <laughs> they're, they're, I've never beaten this game. Are those peanut M&Ms for you? They're for you. That's like, that, those are the snacks I told you about. Oh. Alright. They're for you. Merry Christmas. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy Kwanzaa. For, for Michael's Christmas birthday. He doesn't have a Christmas birthday. For for Xmas, I got him a $20 mm. gift card to the Nintendo's eShop. Mm -hmm. Some some Mountain Dew Voltage and and a bag of peanut M&Ms. Like some friend I am. And then, and then in return, he got me Awesome possum kicks Dr. Machino's butt for the Genesis, which we will <laughs> play on the show probably. <laughs> That's gonna be so much fun. It's gonna be great, dude. Oh. I get to add in another explosion when he hits his head. <laughs> Alright, this is where the game ends. Yeah. I think this is as far as we got in the review. I don't even remember. You know, now that you mention it, the colors do look a little cartoonier in this version. Like uh, the, color, the coloration kind of reminds me of comic sound just a little bit. Well, we are, we are playing with S-Video, first of all, to tell Scar. you guys. Yeah, yeah, SCART. RGB SCART. Mm -hmm. Either or. I was thinking S-Video is a mod you can do that looks even better. No, SCART is better. Well, that's if you want to play with an HDTV. Like, S-Video looks better on a CRT. Mm. Well, if you have a European TV that has SCART, then that looks better. Well, they have yeah, European SCART. Yeah, SCART, SCART was way more common in Europe. That's crazy. But when they brought the systems over to North America, they kept the functionality. Which is why it still works. Oh, okay. Mm. In fact, like when I released my Sonic CD video, and I was talking about how I thought the um, upscaling on the remakes made made Sonic CD look better, they're just like, you only said that because you were using AV, try using SCART. Oh yeah. And sure enough, he's right. It's as if fans know what they're talking about sometimes. Yeah. Maybe you shouldn't disable all your comments and tell me that your fans are all cut and headed nitty muggins. I don't do that though. Yes, you do. <laughs> Whatever you say, at Han. At Hanicus. Yeah. I'm Mephiles the Dark. It's Mephiles, but... Mephiles. <laughs> It's just like you've watched the Sonic 06 play through how many times now and you, you don't even know the guy's name? They call him Mephiles in the cutscenes. They're like, Mephiles the Dark? You're making fun of it. They just call him Mephiles. Mm. That, that, that knife guy is the worst. <laughs> I like how you throw him and then he just fell. Off. I know, that's kind of bullshit. <laughs> oh dear. Here you I like this soundtrack. This, <laughs> the, I like this song a lot. Me. Who's good at video games? Me. Ross. Me. 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 It's just like, how is Ouch. this platform moving around? Construction platform? I don't know. Who cares? Shut up. <laughs> yeah, speaking of the Toy Story 2 game, there's a level of a construction site like this. Did they ever go to a construction site in the movie? No. <laughs> Shit. Fuck! It, God, there, there are Last a couple life. filler levels. How dare they incorporate filler levels? Well, How dare they like, expand upon? You, you oh. still get to go to Al's toy barn, and you still get to go to um, Al's apartment, and the elevator shafts. The elevator shaft. Yeah, they include the elevator. <laughs> the shaft. The elevator shaft. Look at look at the bar. See the bar there. That's where the flickering is coming in. 
see it? I don't see it. How do you not see that? Look right there. See it? See all that flickering? Yeah, I kind of see it. It's my it's my TV. Good. It's my TV, guys. Not not you can't see it at home. Michael thinks that errors on my TV are justified. All right, game's over. <laughs> Bet you guys can't tell which one to which. Yeah, because they make them look even more the same in this version. How? They look the exact same, except for the gloves, and that's it. Can we quit jumping over me, a cock sucker? <laughs> now, that, now that's a bad thing. <laughs> but, you know, I'm just saying that you do it. God. They're more aggressive, too. Yeah, look at that. He's just murdering me. Difficulty balancing is for pussy. Hey, I got an extra life, though. <laughs> just so that we can drag out the place. Yeah, exactly, pretty much. Yeah. So we can so get more can monetization get for it. <laughs> we can make more ad revenue. More advertisement. <clears throat> oh, come on, come on, come on. No! I... Come on! There's a playthrough happening in front of your face. What are you looking at your phone for? I'm waiting for this to end. You can't cheer me on? I'm gonna... No. I hit it one go. more time. <clears throat> okay, that was an interesting way to die, but whatever. And that's it. That's all she wrote. What are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Oh, of course. Hopefully that synced up correctly. <laughs> yeah. Ass. Right in the middle. Oh, that's all the further I got. So that was that was well, playing there's the same, me at the bottom. That was playing the same difficulty. And we got nowhere near as far. Do you guys believe us now? Yeah. <laughs> this Why would anyone ever play the American version? Play the Japanese version. There are copies available. There's ROMs on the interwebs for yeah. you to commit software piracy. You know, <laughs> it's all good. Uh, join us next time, or we'll play Streets of Rage 8. <laughs> bye bye. We'll play Streets of Rage remake. Yeah, if we can find that. Mm. See ya. Yep.